Yeah, the election commissioner here told us uh, last week that Powell got enough signatures to be on the ballot. He'll be on it November 8th running as that independent. Why'd you leave the party? So I could run as an independent and be a conservative on the ballot against two liberals. Kelly and Schmidt. Kansas State Senator Dennis Pyle has served in the Senate with both Democratic Governor Laura Kelly and Republican Attorney General Derek Schmidt. He says he is very different from not just Kelly, but also Schmidt. So to me, you know, the, the fiscal issues and social policies define me as a conservative and and they're definitely a lot farther to the left than I am. Pyle from Hiawatha could make Schmidt's effort to unseat Kelly tougher. Do you feel like the traditional Part of the Republican Party is concerned you're going to keep Derek Schmidt from winning. I'm going to keep Laura Kelly and Derek Schmidt from winning. That's our plan. That's our goal. Pyle had his committee assignment stripped this past legislative session because he did not like the redistricting map the Republicans drew. It put Lawrence into the first congressional district. Emporia State political professor Michael Smith says Pyle is not close with Senate leadership now, so his run for governor won't impact that. It's a little bit like Missouri, where over in the Senate they had that conservative caucus. The Republicans are already conservative, but no matter how conservative Republicans are these days, um, there's always going to be a caucus that is really more alt-right than conservative. Really, really hard right. Schmidt is not commenting on Pyle entering the race right now, but we are interviewing him tomorrow. That story coming up for you tomorrow on Fox 4 News at 5 and 6. Lauren?